Hi everyone, uh, it's Sunday the 11th, I think, of August 2013, and I'm doing another one of these super lazy uh, webcam vlogs, again, which I keep on telling myself I'm not, I'm not going to do, because I need to, like, well, I don't need to up the standard of these vlogs, but I think I should, just for the few people who might be interested in passing, um, these, these ones look really bad quality-wise. And I think I'm off putting to people who might be really interesting audience members um, in terms of leaving feedback, you know, and stuff. Um, but it's these vlogs, as I've ex explained before, aren't really about sort of like having a mass um, audience, but more are more just sort of like for my own record and for those interested who might have something interesting to say. So anyway... Um, and those of you who just naturally enjoy it for whatever reason. Um, so anyway, with that out the so out, out the way, I haven't done a whole lot today, which is partly why I don't feel like pulling my 7D out and uh, setting it up and everything. Um, so I don't really have a lot to say. I've played a lot of computer games, which I'm not meant to do. And I've been away. You know, I remembered at the beginning of today, hey, I should actually do something productive first before getting distracted, because that's something I've really recognised is that I go to distractions first, which is a habit that I need to break. Um, however, I just went and did it anyway, uh, which isn't good. But um, I think part of my brain thought, oh, well, it's Sunday, which is <laughs> the age-old excuse of it being the weekend, which um, I guess normal people do weekends. Maybe I should as well. I just feel like, because um, I really want to get stuff set up and established, and have some kind of success before the end of the year, um, I do feel um, quite a bit of pressure that kind of I should be doing something every single day, regardless of if it's the weekend or not, you know. Um, but I went swimming this morning, and then, um, so I got some exercise at least, um, but then I've just been just on YouTube and Twitter and playing games. Um, I've been playing quite a lot of Super Hexagon lately, which is something I don't think I've mentioned, but I kind of dip into that every day and just slowly get better and better. So it's extremely hard, but it's quite fun um, slowly getting better at it, and then it feels like a real achievement when you actually complete a level. Like, I've completed the first two levels, and um, there's only six in total. Um, so I'm just making noise. Um... What else? In Animal Crossing, I got a petal tail dragonfly, which I was really worried I wasn't going to get, um, because a couple of days, they only appear between 5 and 7, and a couple of days I logged in at 5 and, you know, with, and had some, you know, TV on or sort of like listened to a podcast while just running around looking for one for like one and a half hours, and didn't find one, and read up about it, and... Um, a couple of guides say, oh, well, the more flowers and trees you have, uh, the less likely they are to appear because flowers and trees, um, you know, are like spawning grounds for other types of insects. So it kind of reduces the space that a petal tail dragonfly can spawn in, yada, yada. So I was thinking, oh, I need to cut down a load of trees, maybe. And then my axe broke. This is a really interesting story, right? And then, um, but I just logged in today at like half five. I went, oh, it's half five. Maybe I should have a quick look, see if I can find a petal tail. Logged in, um, walked across to my town square, just like first direction I went, and there was just one there. Um, I thought that's got to be it. It looks really big. Um, apparently, they're really hard to catch uh, if they do start running away because they're really fast, but luckily, it was quite close to me, and I just like took one or two steps and kind of, I just grabbed it really quick before it moved. Um, so, yeah, I'm happy with that. So, anyway, well, anyway that's my petal tail dragons, <laughs> dragonfly story. So, I didn't have to chop down trees in the end after all. I just got lucky. I also played a whole lot of scrolls today. Um, I'm trying to get up to rating 1500. Um, I did actually do quite well today, though, because I started below 1400 and I've got up to like 1450. Um, so fingers crossed I might get to 1500 it seems to be the ceiling for me at the moment though I think I maybe need to work out a better deck than just um, this kind of aggro growth deck that I'm playing at the moment um, I was also watching a bit of the uh, Owlcast 
uh, it's Blinky doing it today, doing some Decay stuff over on the test server, and Decay just looks crazy. It also looks really OP, but that might just be Blinky playing it, but, um, but it is also test server, so maybe, you know, they might um, nerf a couple of things here and there uh, before it gets released. But um, but the actual design, like the monsters and stuff, just look really cool. So I'm quite excited about that. Hopefully um, it won't be too game-breaking because I don't know if I'll be able to get them all straight away. I think the best option is to either fork out some more money for shards or um, save up some gold to buy the pre-con. Um, so I'll probably try and save up some gold for the pre-con, I think. Do it that way. Um, but I don't know. I'll see. Um, oh, I'll, I'll try and find out closer to the time just how OP or not OP it is. Because if it's not OP, then there's no there's no real rush to sort of like collect decay. I mean, I'll just collect it as I go along. If it's not completely, um, if it's not the new meta kind of thing, though, I imagine it will be quite hard to play against because people uh, we won't have like worked out the best strategies against it yet, and also a lot of kind of um, good decks might not be so good against Decay. I don't know. I need to look into it. Anyway, that's a really long, <laughs> this really long vlog. I wasn't expecting it to be this long today. Um, also, Breaking Bad is back today, so I'll um, I'll try and catch that before tomorrow. I maybe have something to say about it. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. So, um, so I think that's everything. So I hope you're well, and I will see you tomorrow.